Hey guys, Critter here. This is going to be a video of how you can save some weight by leaving your crampon case at home. Compress the crampon to take up less space. I'm going to run this strap as close as I can to the crampon, squeeze it down, up over the back end, around this little part, up, and done. Now you can see the difference in size. I'm going to do the same thing to the other crampon. After I have them strapped down, I put them together. I put the toe points inside the heel points. That way, there's nothing sharp exposed to stab anything. Okay, I muted this scene because it was a little too enthusiastic even by my standard. I was trying to show that the full featured packs like Gregory and Osprey all have these straps on the bottom of the pack. You can cinch up the pack uh, like that, uh, and then I say some more stuff that I wasn't too excited about. Now if you're an ultralighter, you likely have something like this Go Light. These packs save weight by cutting out on that bottom strap, but you can fix up something by tying off to somewhere else on the pack. Now, if you're like me, and you probably are, being on backpacking light, you overnight and climb with a day pack. In this case, you're going to do the same thing. You're going to stack your crampons, points protected, and you're going to look for an outside place to tie off to. I grew up with a Green Beret who told me anything that you want to tie off to the outside of your pack, you need to double tie. So we're going to find one place on each crampon, again, to tie off to. That way if one spot fails, we have another spot to keep us held. Just like you can see this pad's tied on two times. Anyways, that's how you do your crampon thing. Thanks for watching.